Hello everyone, this is Happy Nian, the longest continuous flight time in orbit for a Chinese astronaut, the first Chinese woman to work in space, two space license. On April 16, Shenzhou 13 successfully returned to Earth. And this record-breaking space journey continues to generate buzz overseas. The U.S. space website tweeted on April 16 that China's record-breaking Shenzhou 13 crew returned to Earth. On the overseas social media Twitter, netizens have also congratulated. Congratulations to the Chinese astronauts for their safe and successful return. The world should be proud of them. Warmly welcome the Chinese astronauts who returned from picking stars. In the overseas tweets praising Chinese astronauts Taikonaut, the exclusive English world for Chinese astronauts has become a high-frequency world, and the entry of Technot into the overseas lexicon is a testament to the tremendous development of China's space. China has been banned from the International Space Station due to U.S. obsession and is largely on its own to advance its Tango Space Station program. According to an Associated Press article, AFP said April 16 that U.S. and Russia astronauts have decades of experience in space exploration, and that China is now making great strides in this array. Today, China's space career has come a long way, Reuters said in an article. With the successful manned mission of Shenzhou 13, the Chinese space station will enter the construction phase, which is not only a major achievement for China, but also good news for the whole world. Foreign astronauts are welcomed on Chinese space station, not India today. If the International Space Station is retired in the next few years as planned, China may become the only country to operate a long-term orbiting space station in space, DPA predicts. Researchers around the world are eagerly awaiting the completion of the Tiangong Space Station, according to an article in The Nature, which was published as early as the successful launch of the Shenzhou 13 manned spacecraft. The director of the United Nations Office for Outer Space Affairs Samanita the People has also described China's opening of the space station as a great example. This is Happy Nian. See you next time.